Good morning and welcome to Vine Daily. It's day five. Wow, we talked about having the assurance in Christ. And I share some of the ways that we can be assured, trust, and have confidence in God on our walk. We talked about on day one, how you can be assured in your salvation. God assures us that Jesus Christ has come in your life, that your sins are forgiven and that you have eternal life. On day two, we talked about knowing that you are loved unconditionally, that you are chosen, adopted, and loved into the family. On day three, we talked about having the treasure, the word of God, what an amazing gift, and that we can trust God's word. Day four, we talked about the privilege of prayer and the conversation with God. Listen, to be able to trust and have assured faith in God is to know who He is in your life. You may have embarked on this new way of living, becoming safe, and learning how to figure things out. It starts with the relationship. You may be one that has already a relationship, a degree, or been saved for a very long time. Or maybe just need a reminder that all these things we talked about this week are the things that you needed to hear to help you grow more or just to feel assured again. Wherever you're at, remember, you have a new lifestyle. Let me leave you with this. You show your love for Jesus by doing as he says. A good foundation is important and being reminded every once in a while, it helps us to keep going. Obeying God will give you a solid foundation and you, be, you will be assured in that. John 14 and 15. If you love me, keep my commandments. Philippians 2 and 13. For it is God who works in you both to the will and do his good pleasure. Today, write down areas of your life where you're obeying God and areas that you're not. Begin to pray and ask God to help you and to show you what to do. God bless you and thank you so much for joining me all week. And my prayer is that God assures you in every area of your life that you're not alone and we can trust in him. God bless you.